This is Hamish's Bluebird. It's a U12. as well, it's got a water leak. We've got the pop filter like on the Corolla that we had, yeah. rocker cover, painted. Still needs quite a bit of work, but does the trick. Yeah. It sounds pretty good. Get the cold start. Yeah. Pretty cool. Uh, I'll basically just film you drive away down. Look at that here. Yeah. <laughs> it's something. It's something. The nice wooden steering wheel. Yeah. Momo. And the temp gauge that both temp does gauges not that work. don't work. <laughs> I Rip. could make it work, but it doesn't read like right. Oh yeah. That's pretty, true. Pretty shape. We'll do more videos on this and my bluebird at a later date. That's right guys, he's got one too. <laughs> yeah, dun dun dun. <laughs> but yeah, I just thought I'd show it to you. Whoever you is. <laughs> Whoever's watching. Probably us. Yeah, it'll be us again. <laughs> oh well. We've been our most loyal subscribers. Yeah. <laughs> Have a good drive. One eternity later. <laughs> We're getting um, wheels for the Bluebird that I brought. And wheel nuts. And we've got some wheel see. nuts there. So, yeah. So, this is it. It's a car. It's a bit rough, but. Yeah, it's a bit rough, but we'll, we're going to tidy it up. Put the knees on as well. Those are the wheel nuts we've got. And yeah, that's about it. So let's just get the wheels out. Yeah. As you can see, we've got oh. a few projects on the go, <laughs> but it's all right. These There's are more up. than a few. <laughs> this is what we're really after. Yeah. These are the rims. Not bad, good size. <laughs> Be free. <laughs> Mighty steed. Perfecto, they're all in there. Alright, so we're just going to the gas station, pump these wheels up, and here we go. Yeah. Squeaky. I need to tighten that. Yeah, probably. So yeah, it's a five speed. Oh. That's how it is. Oh, there's a cop. Act natural. Doesn't surprise me where we are. So yeah, it's a five speed SR18 direct injection. Um, that's all I have to say about it, really. gonna pull you over a bit. Yeah. Yeah. Surprised it doesn't leak. It's, it's a triple S model. Yeah, yeah. What your windows don't leak? Yeah. 
It survived the winter though, so yeah. it's a good sign. But yeah, it'll be pretty cool to get it back on the road. It just needs we're gonna do the engine mount, the wheels, and sort of just go from there. We've got springs on the way too. Yeah. Lowering springs. So it's gonna be slammed. Yeah, that'll be cool. And it definitely needs an alignment and a new wheel, steering wheel. Yeah, the steering wheel's a bit rough. To the, say the least. Yeah, to say the least. <laughs> That's right, we'll show you. <laughs> it, it looks like a clay ball that we got. Yeah. Check out the yellow high <laughs> Oh, and the black one with the orange wheels. <laughs> Alright, we've arrived at our destination. Pumped up, easy as that. Now we hit that. <laughs> Alright, back in the shed to get our friend, the Jack. Jack. I shall grab. Some tools. So loose, but now I remember we didn't, didn't tighten them. hardly tighten them. See this one's as flat as a pancake. Yeah, and this one is gone. <laughs> uh, out with the old and in with the new. Do you need one of these? I'll need one of those. Cool. Socket. So it's your lock nuts in it, we can steal it. Nice. I need to give these a bit of a clean up, but I'll do that once it's on the road. Yeah. It's all coming together now. I've got a whole lot of cleaning stuff we can use anyway. Oh, nice. Got it for Christmas. Sweet. Now we just rattle gum those in. <laughs> How many agate lugs? Three. <laughs> And it comes with both of the sockets you need, which is cool. And then you don't lose it, otherwise you'll never be able to take them off again. <laughs> or you'll have to buy another I mean, set. Yeah, or you could like pipe wrench them or something. But yeah, just don't lose it, it's simpler. Much easier. The 21 or a 19 or a 19. I'll do that sweet on the ground, and then yeah, I'll just do the same. Hi, 
Oh, you won't even have a front lip. You lucky bastard. Yeah, it's quite cool that little lip, eh? Here we go. <laughs> Get it on. Bit of a goof sometimes. <laughs> Looks pretty good. Be better once it's loaded. Alright, so 110 Newton meters. Alright. guys it's got a nismo sticker that's obviously not one that's just been put on there it's true nismo speak <laughs> obviously had a replacement strut at some stage too you know that as you can tell by the rust the road too hasn't been driven for a while but that'll change soon hopefully Got me nuts. <laughs> Timber! Nice. And it will be very good to address this issue at some stage. Like, I can almost fit my head in there. <laughs> so, yeah. That clearance needs to change. Yeah. Get rid of these. I'll just keep all of these just in case. Yeah, good spears. Stick this in the glove box. And you go. Quite cool. It has all of the original book. It's all in Japanese. We'll and why we need to change the steering wheel too. Yeah. That's dun, why. Dun. <laughs> they pretty much shanked it. Instead of taking the screws out of the back, which uh, where are they? Oh, Somewhere. Yeah, instead of taking out those, like a normal person, they decide to rip this up and hack this piece out. Because, YOLO, the, it came with this wing mirror, which has been taped up for some unknown reason. Yep. So, luckily Hamish had a spare one off a, another bluebird. Another bluebird, so we stuck that in. The pins are different, but... Well, it's a three plug compared to a five, but we'll just pick the pins and change the plug over. Yep, and this is the list of things that we have to do. Yep. There's a couple, it's a long list, but you know, what it project doesn't have a long list. Exactly. I'm pretty sure wheels, cross that off. Wheel nuts, we don't have it on here, but cross that off the yep. metaphorical list. And, um, bled the brakes up too. Yep, we bled the brakes. So that's all we've done so far. Not much. There is at all. a wee crack in the gas tank, but we will address that at a later date. Yeah, we'll get a new one shipment. Uh, 
Um, yeah. Have to get my head unit too because there's nothing there. And this is, I want to fix, I want to put this like, so that it sticks on there properly. Mm. Like with some wire or something, but. See staples, staple bound. The, yeah, true. That's yeah. that. It's, the shift knob's a little bit loose. But does the job. Doesn't come off, so. Does what it needs to. Yep. And we need to get a couple more of these. Well, mm. actually, a couple more of these. Yeah. Because the windows don't really work right now. The driver's window doesn't. I fixed the rest of them. Ah, oh, this one needs a switch. But it does still go up and down. But I fixed yeah. the other two. And also, this is the highest K car that I've ever owned, I think. <laughs> <laughs> but it'll be alright. Sure, you It's a Nissan. Um, oh, and this air freshener is pretty cool. So I just left that in there. Fair but enough. that's not cool. Yeah. It's just straight up gun. Might need to get the trumpet in here. Yeah, I think. At least I'll actually be able to clean it. Yeah. Um, oh, also, they left a weapon of mass destruction, a turtle killing... <laughs> killing <storm>. machine? <laughs> but I don't know, what can you do? Ah. Yeah, she's a bit rough under here. Ah. So yeah, yeah, it's a little bit different from the Corolla, but... It's right, it is. different is good. We can change a lot of this, hopefully. May even put a... SR20 in. Yeah, I kind of want it to make turbo sound in the future. That'd be cool. Yeah. 20 deep. Also, we've got some quality <laughs> battery holding going on here. Does the trick. Yep. As you can see by the mount, it's just completely blown out. Yeah, that's. Oh, I'll go get another mount. It's. To put it nicely, fucked. <laughs> completely munted. Okay, so that's all I've got so far on my Bluebird because um, New Zealand's in lockdown now, so you have to stay home and do stuff on your own. So I've done a few things. I've got a parked car out there, so I've taken all the interior out of that and put it into my one because it's a lot nicer. And um, I swapped the engine mount out. I finally managed to get it in after a lot of wiggling and prying. I got it to go in and put that in, so I've got the new engine mount. A lot of new interior and yeah I'll just show you how the car looks on the inside now and then we'll call it a day. So as you can see I've put in a new steering wheel I really like the look of the stock just clean steering wheel a new glove box from the other car I've got this shift boot, which I'm really happy I found. It just fits perfectly, because that's how they're supposed to be. And these two seats are out of the other one. This makes it a lot cleaner and nicer. And, got new door cards on every door now. And, um, the central locking works. We've got window switches on all of them. The only window that doesn't go down still is the driver's one. So I'm pretty sure I can fix that. So yeah. Door cards in the back are mint. Well, as mint as they can be for now. And I just need to throw the back seat in. And um, it'll be all good. And I don't know if that if there's anything else I need to show you really. Yeah. Right. That's the new engine mount in there. Nice and good. All bolted down and good to go. And as you can see here, I put the darker side light covers on just because I think they look cool that is everything I've done on it so far so if you want to see more progress on my bluebird and on Hamish's bluebird he's done a lot of progress and he's got some big plans coming up um, subscribe and we'll make some more videos because we like making them and they're fun to look back on mainly so even if no one watches
The other thing is I got these springs which we were going to stick in to lower the car but it turns out that they're for an Atessa four wheel drive model and they're too big. They don't work which is a big shame. But I do have these wheels that I really like. I think they're really cool. Made in New Zealand factory Nissan wheels and I'm excited to get them on at some stage. Subscribe to see the future progress on our builds. Thank you for watching guys.